Hey y'all, this is Kelly at Crochet My For Life. Well, this is take two because I just finished my video and I went back to watch it and my hair was sticking straight up right there like a little cow lick. So I think I got it down a little bit now. Maybe so. Y'all excuse it. I got my hair cut today. Uh, go back to work tomorrow and uh, been off for three days and so i wasn't going back to work till i found somewhere say it's just all till i can get it cut today so i put some hairspray on it while ago i was looking pretty like i had a bowl put around my head so i had to go wash it again and get all pretty fine i reckon as best i could for y'all on this video but so it anyway excuse the little cow lick it's going to get laid down tomorrow when I go to work because I'm going to slick it down. So I got it cut today. But I wanted to get down here today, uh, tonight, and show you my finished pretty um, that I did. Uh, started it yesterday and finished it up today. And it probably, some of y'all pretty, pretty should have got it out in an hour or so. But it took me a while because, you know, I watch my shows and get up and do this and that and the other. And... <clears throat> And um, just generally just lollygag and um, but I got it finished and I'm gonna take it to work tomorrow to give to my boss lady uh, to take to her little son she has a boy and a girl and uh, I told you about my monkey I made and I'm giving the little girl the monkey and the little boy wanted a flash he asked his mama if, if that crochet lady knew how to make a flash so I, I downloaded a pattern off Etsy and uh, so I finished it, and I wanted to come on here and show you before I turn it loose. And uh, <clears throat> just say hi, and um, I go back. Like I said, I go back to work tomorrow, and I don't know when my next day off is. And and it may take me a little bit to try to finish up something else to get on here to show you. But um, here is um, the pattern I got. Like I said, I got it off Etsy. I will link the pattern below. I'm not sure what I paid for. It might have been four or five dollars, and um, I don't mind doing that because I'd rather pay for a pattern reasonably. You know, five dollars is usually how high I go. I don't go no higher than that. But <clears throat> I I like to do that instead of the free ones. And I do free ones sometimes, but you got to get through all the mads. And um, I'll be scrolling to look at my pattern, then all of a sudden. I'll lay it down, look at it, and look, crochet. Next thing I know, my, my screen's going blank, going black. And I had to start all over to try to get it pulled back up. And it's just aggravating. So I'd rather have a pattern in my hand. And I will link this pattern in my description box if there's anybody else that needs a flash in their life. So, But here is my flash. And um, I think he turned out pretty cute. This is some uh, Mainstay Red. This is some Big Twist uh, Varsity Gold, I think. This is Mainstay White. And some Embroidery Thread. <clears throat> and uh, this is some Buff, Red Heart Buff. So, but there's my flash. The pattern didn't call for a nose, so I didn't put a nose on them. I, um, this is made all in one piece. You know, the body... And the head is in one piece and then you make the arms you make up <clears throat> the little ears or whatever they are and the little emblem and then you embroidery a little lightning bolt the mask <clears throat> you make it and then you put it on the head <clears throat> and what i did is i did like llama llama kayla does because i was tired so i just hot glued this stuff on I hot glued the little emblem, the little antenna ears, and I put some glue right between the eyes and right up underneath here just to make it stay. Of course, I did sew, you know, around this part, you know, just to make sure it stays. So I hope Mason likes it. It was fun. It was easy. And if you're not a slow poke like me, you could get it done within an hour or two, I'm sure. But, so that's my flash, and I just wanted to get on here and um, show it to you. I made it 
with my Hobby Lobby hook I've been favoriting and using a whole lot. This is a 5.5 H hook and I really enjoy that hook. So that's what I did this weekend. I worked on my ombre blanket and I've been telling y'all that <clears throat> that colorway was purple. But it's not purple because I dug through my avalanche over here. And I found me two more skeins, and the colorway is violet ombre, red heart. So I got that out, got my two skeins out, and I'm still working on that. And I dug out some uh, green apple ombre, and I started on the iguana. Now, I don't know when I'll get the iguana done. I may squirrel and do start something else. That's just the way life is right now. But I got the little flash done. I fulfilled my promise to Mason and Michaela, or to their mama, to get them something finished. So, um, that's about it for me. Um, we went to Ollie's and I saw all that pretty yarn, but I didn't buy none. We went to Walmart. I, uh, I touched some yarn there. I didn't buy it. And um, about the only thing I... I really splurged on was a bunch of these little glasses at the Dollar Tree. I bought me six pairs of them. And I probably got about 12 pairs around here somewhere in this house. But I always like, I seem like I'm always reaching for them, you know. <clears throat> and I bought some snacks at Ollie's because Ollie's has the best snacks. <clears throat> but other than that, you know, this weekend's been pretty restful. Um, i uh been watching shows and YouTubes and all that and I got all my, I got my watch hours in so thank you Miss KK K and K crochet for telling everybody about getting my watch hours and I got my watch hours and I don't know what to do next but I got them so they may send me a check for a quarter I don't know I'm not really in for it you know like I said I'm not in in it for that but it'd be nice you know but Anyway, that's about the extent of my little um, weekend. Uh, today, I went to the Dollar Tree and uh, the family Dollar Dollar Tree together. And I had to go get some toilet paper. And I dropped my phone and I broke my, my um, cracked my screen. That irritated me all a whole lot. And uh, But if that's the worst thing that happened to me today, then I'm doing good, ain't I? So... I, I tried to see about getting me a replacement and have that insurance, you know, and it's just like insurance, you know, you pay for it and then then when it comes time you need it, you still got to pay for it. And they want $189 just to fix this phone. And I said, well, I'll just live with it for a while because I can still see, you know, on it. It's just got a bunch of spider webs. <laughs> I hate I done that, you know. I don't know if y'all's Dollar Trees or and Family Dollars and Dollar Generals is like ours, but they have all kind of mess anyway. And then I, I had to get some toilet paper. So I went back there to get toilet paper. And when I went up to pay, she said, ma'am, she said, this is lavender toilet paper. I said, oh, no, I can't do no lavender toilet paper. It ain't conducive for my behind. So she said, well, go get another one. So I went back there to get it. Well, the toilet paper is stacked the sky high, and it's not stacked, stacked like a good little Jenga box. You know, it's all messed up. So, in with, trying not to get all the toilet paper falling on me, I dropped my phone and broke it. But, it's all right. It'll be okay. Well, I just guess I've ran it enough, so I'm going to hop off here, and um, I hope y'all have a great week. Um... Maybe I can get back on next week or before if I have anything to talk about, anything to show you. And uh, we'll see each other soon, I'm sure. So y'all take care, and uh, I'll see you next time. Bye, y'all.